Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting the fine citizens of New York City to the threats they don't even know about. Namely, that menace, Spider-Man. Our first caller is, what'd you say your name was? Hi, uh, this is Peter Patterson. Don't you think you're a little hard on Spider-Man? Let me tell you something, Patterson. Spider-Man treats New York City as his own personal playground. Just yesterday, I saw him doing backflips and 360s. Disgraceful running and crawling on buildings. In fact, I have it on good authority that he's been doing swan dives off of skyscrapers. It seems the more confident he gets, the more creative he gets. Walk like a normal person. Oh, come on, what's wrong with a little sightseeing? Uh, New York is super diverse and constantly changing. Uh, maybe he's just looking for vantage points to monitor crime? Crime he's causing, you mean. Sources tell me he has backpacks filled with who knows what hidden throughout the city. Unauthorized research stations. Get a permit like the rest of us, loser. Ever since he came onto the scene, prancing around like an 80s action hero, gangs have been setting up shop, using warehouses, construction sites, and rooftops as bases of operation, putting lives at risk. Who does he think he is? Spider cop? I really feel like he's trying to help people. I don't want to hear it. The fine people of New York deserve better. My uncle once said, with great power, there must also come great responsibility. Maybe this is just his way of growing into the hero he wants to be. And from what I've seen, the people seem to be A-OK -okay with that. Agree to disagree, Patterson. Spider-Man only cares about one thing, himself. Jameson out.